You should never live for things that are temporal. Even our husband, our family, everything is temporal. Everything that we see is only temporal. But only the things that we should live for are the things that are eternal. And so, so that's why love is stronger than anything you see. And because love is eternal, because it's not sin. Anything that is not sin, kindness is stronger than anything you see physically. So love is stronger than wife. Love is stronger than husband. Love is stronger than children. Love is stronger than money. Love is stronger than country. Love is stronger than anything visible. All the invisible things, the virtues, kindness, uh, patience, all these things, they will outlast the best of men. Even the best of men like me or like your husband or like your wife or like your child will only live maximum five years. I mean, uh, 500 years or 100 years, 200 years. But love will live forever. Faith will live forever. Uh, patience will live forever. You know, hope will live forever. Kindness will live forever. So these are the eternal things that we are supposed to be living for. So eternal things that are not seen are always more valuable. Eternal things, I mean, invisible things are always more precious. So God, when God begins to see us living and giving our allegiance to physical, no, material, temporary things, he knows that these are temporal, because those things are temporal, those things will perish one day, those things will die one day, it means that you too, you make yourself perishable. When you begin to put your faith and trust on something temporal, it means you make yourself temporal but god doesn't want you to be temporal god doesn't want you to be you know to be only momentary god wants you to be eternal god created you to be eternal and the only thing that will make you to live eternally and to live in eternity is for you to be in love to give your heart and commit yourself to something eternal you must commit yourself to God who is eternal. You must commit yourself to love who is eternal. 